Hello, everybody. Shift here again with another first to first dungeon run. And today I'm going to be playing Fire as we did last day. Uh, weapons we're going to use the Impractical Large Sword, which is a neutral weapon, and the Serpent Stick, which is a nature weapon. I just want to test them out. For weapons, we're going to go with a chance to grant you an attack speed globe when you kill an enemy close up, attack speed and pickup radius, and then also plate mail, which gives us a HP regen and a neutral resistance uh, for five seconds after taking damage. So that should be super defensive. And let's actually run into this. Now, I believe fire is one of the perk characters let's see our weapons so first of all we got this thing okay a melee attack nice i love it and then the right click is ay, 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 and it throws out the sword ay, 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 ay. i love it so can i do this and then dash i love it i love it and then the other choice is poison shotgun which the poison does not seem to be stacking okay so this is definitely worse but ah we can test it at least i do enjoy the melee idea here though not that it's doing a lot of damage. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, it does a lot of damage if I throw it out and then the boomerangs effects around. Nice. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. I love it. I really love it. I love the idea of throwing these out and then coming back. Although they do not, as I said, they do not seem to be doing a lot of damage. I think the flame ability she had yesterday was a lot more powerful, but, you know, we're gonna see. It's poison shotgun. Nice, we got Denial. I would say we're gonna take Denial right away. And we're gonna also go into Luck, so we find better items later. Here's the Shotgun effect. Oh, we can also attack very often when I get the attack speed roll from the weapon. Nice, uh, from the Maw or whatever. Let's see what we can get. Electricity resistance and water damage. Uh, electricity resistance is good. Weight and contact damage. I mean, electricity resistance is useless. Dash damage on attacks, but we're gonna take that guaranteed. And... Um, we're gonna take whatever here, I guess. Contact damage and weight. Both of these are useless. I'm gonna take this just for the 20% electricity resistance. Although I'm not even sure if I need it, by the way. Just to be clear about that. Ooh, free intelligence per level up. Uh, I would also like to get adventurous, so I get... Mm, I'm gonna take this right now and hope that I'm gonna find adventure again. Because adventure is like one of the most important things to get early. If not the most important. Oh, this goes where my cursor is? Oh! Okay, this is actually really good then. I'm gonna be a neutral build with a blade thrower. Or I can also be ranged if I want to do so. Look at this, now we're poisoning them and we're keeping them at bay and we're doing no damage. Ay, 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 I guess. I didn't take the plus 50. It is what it is. 0 0.7. Gain your level regeneration while your health is below 50%. And crazy regeneration and nature resistance. Or this. Uh, nature resistance isn't really that good. Regeneration. Having a lot of regen is good. And regenerating a lot when you're low life is also good. Mm, I don't enjoy these that much. I think we're gonna go off to the next ones. I'm, I'm increasing my luck anyway, so I want to find things that give us at least one. Right? Might be wrong about this, but that's my idea here. That we should try to min-max what we find, instead of taking whatever the game provides us with. Nice, we continue gaining the attack speed buff. Nice, and if anything, I'm not even sure if I should even throw out my... Yeah, now we go attack speed! Now we're running down. Okay, we got XP gain. I never found the thing I previously had, by the way. I, I'm, I'm not finding the arsenal thing. The thing that says you heal every time you level up. We want that as early as possible. Like yesterday we got it at level 5. So at this point we already had it. And right now we are still missing it. Maybe the free intelligence per... Yeah, maybe the free intelligence was not the play. I don't know, we're gonna see. Ay, 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 ay. I'd also like to get the, the chest thing early. The free chest thing. Let's see what we can get out of this. Electricity resistance and attack speed. Yeah, why not? Dash damage and neutral damage. Yes, neutral damage is my sword. Water resistance, dash damage. Also, yes. Let's go. Now opponents do double damage to us. But that doesn't matter as now we are more powerful. Survive? No, let's go with one damage. Let's go with wand damage. Sword, sword, sword. Throw the boomerang out there. Let's also continue picking up. Let's also poison opponents. Lock him in the corner. Throws a f the sword plies out wherever. Uh, I just realized I'm not into fire. Therefore, uh, theoretically, I can't really get lifesteal. 
Although, now that they realize it again, I think she gets lifesteal anyway, right? Doesn't she get lifesteal out of her uh, passives? I think she does, so... It doesn't even matter. Lock that guy in. Throw the swords out. Oh, we'll go with a couple of poisons here and there. That's water opponent that I'm yoloing in. We're gonna go adventure this time. I saw that after five levels you got block and regen, but... I need to get this adventure going right this moment. You know what? I can stay away from this guy. I don't need to be close up. Here you go. What's this thing right click? Okay, does that even do anything? Uh, maybe. Maybe it's good. Maybe this thing's right click is good. 0.3 useless. 0.6. This is literally worse than the previous one. We had a 0.8 as a choice. I'm gonna go skip again. I'm gonna go skip again. Ah! Poison seems good. Look how many attack speed things we're getting. Hoi hoi hoi! Hi 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 ya! Hi ya! Putting the sword out isn't a good idea, Daryl. Hi ya! We continue gaining the attack speed. Did the sword bug out? The sword seems like it bugged out. Now it's it's bugged in again. Now it's bugged in! Go with poison dust. Maybe this is a play. Everybody's trying to get us. You're not gonna get us. I got crazy attack speed. Poison them. Maybe the right click poison is good. In one block for every four intelligence. Santa Claus. We're gonna go with Santa Claus. This is also really good, by the way. These are both really good. I'm gonna go with the free chests. Oh, I, I got really luck. I don't need to invest into luck anymore. Now I'm just waiting for the thing that says get um, get 20 luck, lose 20, 10 strength. And I guess I should start investing into strength now. So I maybe get the at 50 strength, gain crazy defense and health regen before I lose the 50 strength. That would be a nice idea. Let's see what I can get out of this. Weight and fire damage. I'm not using fire damage. Water resistance and health. This is actually good. Crit hit rate and electricity damage. I'm not using electricity damage. Yeah, I think I don't want that. I mean, 3% crit rate may be okay, but still um, no reason to make the game harder. Also, we don't know what the next one's gonna give us. I made icicles on combo, burn opponents. First of all, let's transition over to strength, as I said. Let's go with more XP gain at high life. I'm still level 9 and I haven't found the more stats gained, which is very bad and sad. It's okay. Like, we... It's not the end of the world, but it just makes the, war, the run a bit worse overall. Not that anything else really matters here. Hiya, hiya. Throw the blade out. Let's go back with the poison. I do enjoy this pushing opponents off. Here we go. Luck and strength. We're gonna lose the strength. We're gonna get the luck. Which uh, makes us go one step forward, two steps back. But uh, at the end of the day, we, we wanted to get that luck anyway. Like, that, that was the idea from the get-go. Getting that 50 luck early. So that every time we find a new item, it has a higher chance of being a level 1 item. Instead of being a level 0 0.4. That was the plan, so to speak. We're now actually poisoning and hitting everything here as much as we can. That guy's toast. That guy's toast. And now only the tree is left, which is also toast pretty much. It got hit. We got hit. Yeah, this does decent. Like, yeah, okay, maybe the number is, doesn't seem huge. 75, 60 or whatever, but it's good. 0 0.3. Are you serious right now? Cleansing amulet, 0 0.6. Are you serious? I'm gonna take the cleansing amulet, man. I'm gonna take the cleansing amulet even if it's a 0 0.6. I could have had a lot more powerful version a lot earlier, but... It is what it is. Now I won't complain about it. I will try to get HP region epic upgrade at least. Okay, are you serious right now? Uh, I guess we're gonna go with anger. Shoot flames on attack. Yeah, I, I want to go with this meditation and anger meditation is also good, but for now I would say it's a bit important to uh, to get the buff going. I want to get even more XP gain out of that. If I can, I want to get all her passives gathered up. So that's gonna help us, as it always does. I do enjoy this poison weapon, to be honest. I do enjoy that it's splitting and it's also attacking. And it's also global, like it's full screen hitting. And I do enjoy that it doesn't have a charge up and just attacks very often and spreads out. And that's it. A very good weapon, indeed. And also has the shotgun effect. If you're close to opponents, it might make all bullets hit them. Which is also really good, of course. Uh, after 5 levels, I'm gonna gain stats. I'm not finding the permanent stat gain, which is pretty sad. Uh, stay away from me, please. Have I gotten the revive, by the way? I'm not sure I even have the revive. So right now, I'm not even sure if we can survive here. 
fire resistance to infinite. I'm gonna say yes. Electricity resistance and water damage. I don't do water damage. One damage, but lose attack speed. I'm okay with this. Not that much, but I am okay. Electricity resistance and water damage. I mean, at this point, we're maxed out, so might as well super max it out. There is a difference on how maxed out we are. Right now, where, for example, the flames are here. If I press this, um, yeah, the flames go up to the max. But, ah, eh, you know what? Might as well take it. Although, lightning resistance is not a thing. I think I'm making a mistake by doing this. I think with the flames being here at the bottom, it's better. Eh, let's take it, though. Although, once again, lightning resistance is not really a thing. But, Sift, if you know that it's not a thing, why do you take it? Well, because... Uh, the fact of the matter is... Uh, we might get hit by something... At some point. Let's push a bonus off-screen. With a poison. Yep. They're doing 100 damage to us, which is okay. The only downside is that, as I said, we don't have any lifesteal component. We will take that at some point. Here we go, shockwave at long last. Okay, now the next one hopefully is going to be the plus stats. Now I know we got it at level 13, maybe 14 if I get it next, but still, if I get to level 25, that's like 15 points of stats that we're gonna be gaining here, which is pretty decent-ish. Stay away, flame him to the corner. You know what, I don't need to be next to them. I can be here at the very end of the path. This is a trick, this is why we use this weapon. Just stay away. It does its little damage. Opponents do their thing. They're not gonna hit us. And uh, yes, we might not be healing that much, but... Poison! Yep, poison shots. Blade him in. Ay, 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 ay. Got him. Oh, we're fighting a boss. A bit early in my opinion, but it is what it is. I'm fighting myself. Stay away from me. The music's awesome. It's gonna take us a while here until we get rid of her. Mm, it's maybe... Blade throw! Blade throw! Blade throw! Blade throw! Yeah, that does definitely less damage. We're gonna stick to the poison idea. Even if it's gonna take us a year. I really don't wanna go close to her. The music is really good, honestly. Maybe a bit too loud. But I definitely enjoy it. I think I increased my own music. You know what? Let me actually decrease my music over here. Okay, got it. Sorry for not shooting. Blade throw! <laughs> Blade! No, 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 no. That's not a good idea. Stay away from me. Okay, she's gonna do an ultimate in the moment. Okay, so, yep, now she's damage immune for a while. She's just shooting us. I think I have a decent dish regen. Yeah, I mean, I have decent this region because I got the 50% higher region and also permanent region based on my max li on my levels, right? Like, this is a region defense build. We are regening a lot. And I'm also gonna get epic region plus 10. 160 damage taken. Which is not even gonna be plus 10, it's gonna be plus 15. Because, as we said, I got a thing. Right, the amulet gives us 50% more region on everything. And 5 region flat and also region based on my level. She no longer is ultimating, so... Now we just wait. Give me a sec. Let's go. Whoa. <laughs> when you get hit. Sound effects like, you got hit. Block. Poison. 100 plus damage. Imagine if we lose from ourselves. The clone that is more powerful than the master. I mean, the master is not even using the fire weapon. I mean, am I the master? Or is the clone the master? You know what, yesterday I got a thing that says fire stacks. It would be nice if that's for poison true too. I don't think there are poison talents in general. Because there are no poison items, and you get talents based on what items you have. Now, yes, my weapon is a poison weapon, of course, but... Um, I mean items, items, like the passive items that you have on you. I would like to also do like electricity build. Most likely tomorrow I'm gonna have to do an electricity one. Come on, what do you think you're doing? Bye-bye! Coinage! Off we go into the next fight. Did I get a level? Didn't even get a level. Boo! Let's see, can I get some good things here? 0.6. Thor hammer. Or uh, something else on the right there. Ignite. I still have not gotten what I wanted, by the way. Uh, fire damage applies burn. Well, guess what? I don't do fire damage. I guess uh, all the resistances then. So, one. Nice. Block a hit every 13 seconds for free. Lose movement speed. 
I guess I should go for the shield. What does this do? A homing hammer dealing electricity, electricity damage, electric effect. No, this is useless. Let's go with this. Blocks a hit every 13 seconds. For free, so a guaranteed hit block. That's good. 13 seconds is a it's pretty much of a big, too big of a cooldown to be honest. But it is what it is. Machine gun effect sword. Blade attacks. Yeah, I'm not about how good the blade attacks are. Let's go back to the poison. Especially with the keeping them at bay option here with the dust. I'm dying. I don't have the revive, right? Yeah, I don't have a revive. Uh-oh. We might very well die here. As I said, I don't have a revive. At least I do have dashes. Every two seconds. Every one second, actually. Not even every two seconds. That's how busted this is. Attack speed goddess. It's still raining meteors, by the way. Uh, yeah, we're gonna go with XP gain and health. The less health that is. I'm waiting for the crazy plus uh, 50 health roll that she gets at the final version of that. So we're becoming weaker and weaker and then at the end of this... Is after anger the acceptance? I don't know when acceptance is. Let's see what we get. Oh, we start getting free stuff. One damage, water damage, nature damage, pick up amount, item 23, crit damage, darkness, no. Log and health, yes. Yeah, we're gonna stick to only the downsides we already have. It was a very small difference there. Nice machine gun. Please give me the thing I want. Are you serious? I still have not gotten what I want. We're gonna go with killing blow prevention. There. Which is really important in my opinion. I have, I have started comboing very often. So maybe I should invest into that thing that says that when I combo I get the icicles effect or whatever. Could be good. Poison them away. Yeah, it feels like this this thing here does a lot of damage. Although it, it doesn't look like it, but it really feels like it. I think I want to go with block per intelligence. That's going to give us a lot of block. How much block do I have? The next hit you take will be harmful. Okay, that's helpful. <sighs> yeah, let's go for this. So theoretically, I'm getting a lot of attack speed whenever I'm not getting hit or something. Which uh, I would like to get anger if I can. So that I can actually get the anger meditation. Although, do I even have a single fire item to be able to go into that? I'm not sure if I have a single fire item. Hey, look, it's a nice bunny. It's an icicle bunny. Awesome. Fighting poison with poison. Uh, yeah, you're not gonna do anything to us. Meditation once again. Soul of the honey badger. 3D nature resistance. Ah, a bit irrelevant. Let's get this. Fire damage. I think for us to get the thing I want, I need fire item. For us to be able to get 1.9. Oh, yeah. This is good. I'm gonna go for this. Place snow patches when you dash. I, I never had this. I never ever had the ice boots. Movement speed, dash, water speed. Water speed? How fast you move through water? I don't care about this. Fire resistance is good, though. Place snow patches when you dash. Emit fire bolts when dash. This is a 1.9, man. Terms of movement speed, dash rate, and health. We're gonna go for the left one. The right one is good if it was higher level. The left one is straight up better for this run. I'm gonna find this at some point. As a higher level and we're gonna take it then. But now we're sticking to what I think is best. And now we also can find fire item. Therefore I should be able to get anger. Unless I'm not understanding how this works correctly. <laughs> I'm gonna find anger. But before I do that, I would like to get... Wait a minute. Have I already gotten 4 stat points per level up? I think I already found it. I'm mixing up what has happened in this game and what has happened in other games. Which is of course pretty bad. Please stay away from me. I'm still only getting 3 points. <laughs> Phoenix Badger. Okay, I'm 50 at this, so uh, time to go into attack speed for a moment. Until I get 25 on luck. And then we're gonna transition over to intelligence for the rest of the game. Please give me the stat point collection, please. At this point, I'm level 19, which means I now want to get epic talents. Which is uh, another thing that we need to get, right? Whoop. Good of all the elites. Let's see what we get. This is free. Darkness damage, neutral damage, water damage, crit hit rate, and contact damage, mediocre. Nature, damage, damage, pick up a mon electricity. This is useless. Dash, damage, and electricity. Damage. This is also useless. Yeah, for, not for once, I'm gonna allow it to cool down. Uh, this is all of these are useless. Let's allow the allow, allow the boss to cool down. Allow the boss to cool down for once. 
Let's play on easy mode, you know, no meteors, no nothing. This, ha, okay, the grind is here. Depression and then is acceptance. Let's take the grind. Now we're level 20. That's like five skill points. Because at, le at around level 25, maybe, maybe 30, you know, somewhere around there the game ends. Somewhere around there. Uh, I don't think the meters are shown anywhere, but I think I can pause and see. Like, at around 2,000 meters, 200, 2,100. Let me actually pause for a moment. Can I see where I am? You can see how mad this guy is. That's good. Uh, I can see my money, 800 something. So at around 2,000 coins is when you're close to death. At least that's my... That's what I have seen happen in this game. That's my experience, so to speak. Movement, speed, and damage. Dash. Effect damage and contact damage. I would like to get Squire and parry and apply pressure on Blade Dance and Burning Blade, like all of these. Movement, speed, and dash damage for Bernie. I am very little into fire, so I don't really want to go into Bernie play. Let's go here. I, uh, I'm not really taking these lately. Those are uh, the slash build items. Let's also maybe play melee. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Is that a good idea? I don't think it's a good idea. Trying to get rid of the one boss while the other boss just appeared. Did that other boss just survive or... I don't even know what happened. Stay away from me. And now we can push your way and... So this is like a natural enemy or something like that. A nature enemy or nature affected. And by the way, it seems like my projectiles can hit his projectiles. Yeah, because the projectiles they shoot out become smaller and smaller. That's... that's weird. That's uh, that's really weird. Yeah, I just make them disappear in the mid-flight. That's good to know. Still weird, but also good to know. That That's a thing. Eight icicles whenever you combo. Or get good block. And heal when you block. Once every 10 seconds. Emit icicles when you combo. And flourishing mind. Yeah, let's go with this. Now I got dexterity to the numbers I want them to be. 0.5 Icicle Spear, 0.5 key Calm Keeper. Both of these are part of the build. So, shoot an Icicle Spear to your cursor every 3.8 seconds. Nearly 100 damage, contact damage, crit rate, and crit damage. Let's go with this. I have never ever had that. That's a new thing that I never had. Ceiling something. He said something here. Oh, I, I just saw the Icicle. Okay, so that's of course effect damage, by the way. Opponents are moving faster. Keep them at bay by sword throw. Okay, maybe don't keep them at bay. Poison them. Poison them again. Smarty brain. 10 more damage. The pre oh, neutral resistance and damage resistance. This is really good. Slash at the closest enemy on block and give you 20 block. Uh, I think I don't want to go dexterity anymore. Let's start doing damage. I want to be done with acceptance, by the way. I want to start gaining my stats back and my 40. Whoa! I got hit for 400? Do opponents do crits? Or was that literally the rest of the damage we're gonna be taking is gonna be through the roof here? Because, um, yeah, I can tell you right now. We need to get something very specific. Oh, I got a telephone from an unknown number, so I need to pick that up right now. Give me a second, sorry for that. Okay, I am back. So, uh, let's continue, let's continue. And then now I instantly die because I lost the train of thought that I was going on. Yeah, I don't know if I was talking about anything. That, that's, that train of thought is gone. Uh, stronger, stronger. So, this is crazy good, of course, but I want to get the acceptance as fast as possible. Is that really an idea here? Acceptance or go for the damage resistance and HP region. Let's go for the... Let's go for this. It also gives us lifesteal. We're gonna kill our movement speed here. That's what I'm doing, but YOLO. This is free. Water resistance, neutral damage. Neutral damage is the slash. I love this. Dash damage, neutral resistance. This is really, really good. Neutral damage, and attacks within crit rate. This is actually godlike. Critted rate and health. This is also good. And it doesn't even g g bring us over to that opponent's do more damage. The free trinket is a godlike. Man, the free trinket is really good. Especially if it gives you a trinket you want. But right now it maybe didn't. Ay -ay 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 I'm not sure about the sword, man. <laughs> it's, it's a jokester. It's a joke weapon. I love it though. I love it for the fact that we have it. Not for the fact that it's good or not. It doesn't matter to me if it's good or not. I'm attacking and doing the poison, the dust training. Uh, no, I think we're gonna go epic talents. Maybe I should go a bit more dexterity to have attack speed and damage rate and whatnot. 
Let's go with Epic Talents, by the way. Here, I want some specific things uh, on the Epic Talents choices. Whoa, that was a lot of damage. I would like to get the um, damage immunity duration. That is considered to be the better one to get. And uh, the rest that I would like to get is... I don't know, effect damage for sure. What is it? Neutral damage. It rolled fire and water. Nature is trash. I want it rolled neutral. In general, neutral is the most important part to actually be able to level up. We're gonna go here. We're gonna go with block rate. Let's continue with damage, actually. I take back the idea of dexterity. Once again, dexterity is movement speed and dash rate. So you get more dashes out of it. Also a bit more movement speed. And attack speed. Dexterity in general is awesome. Like, what else do you want other than movement speed, attack speed, and dash rate? Which dash rate is, of course, immunity, right? Damage immunity. Uh-oh, we're dying. Please be away from that guy over there. You stay also away from me. I'm afraid of this cloud. Like, uh, at, at least the, at least that guy over there just, just shoots out from afar. The cloud is straight up stupid. Ooh, poison it. Keep away your neutral damage from me. Your little swordy blades. I do enjoy that we got elites with, I guess, unique-ish effects. Come on, we got you, man. What are you even trying to do? What are you trying to achieve? Got him. Got him? Got him. Nice. Now here we should find our last item. Calm Keeper 0.6. Can I stop getting trash, please? Fire Maw 1.2. That's decent. Fire Resistance through the roof and strength. Gain attacks with reach. Enemy close to you stacks up to five times. Uh, I'm gonna get the fire maw, breath fire around you every whatever. Now we got this thing going, where whoever is close to us will get blamed. Crit damage, intelligence, epic speed. Just be less slow. <laughs> the idea there. Uh, one damage, I got the plus four or crit hit rate. I think we're gonna go for the one damage and intelligence. Straight up more damage here. Damage and even more damage. Attack speed. Oh, now we're doing 100 plus. Now we're doing 100 plus per attack. That's actually good. How much does the slash do? Yeah, this does so much less. I think poison is the play. I think poison is the play. Hundreds of damages. Stay away from me, everything. Okay, we got rid of that elite over there. It got just pushed off screen. Or at least I'm trying to push it off screen. Increase your intelligence of 25 your current amount. I think I'm gonna pull the trigger on this right now. I could try later, but I'm level 8, 28. I'm not gonna get that much more. Let's get this right now. So we get the crazy damage right this moment. As I said, we could have waited for later. But at some point, we're just gonna die. So um, how, how long will I wait? When do you think is the perfect time to do that? Let's see what we get. Imagine if this is my best one ever and I get like to level a million. So light damage, useless, neutral resistance, really, really, really good. Contact damage, electricity damage, useless. Contact damage and crit hit rate. 10% crit hit rate. That's good. Nature damage and pickup amount, but lose health. I want this, but... Oh nice, it doesn't even bring us through the roof. No, 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 we're gonna stick to this one. Crit hit rate, of course, is the important part here. With the crits doing more damage... Uh, yeah, 75% multiplicator other damage, as far as I know. I mean, I can test, I can check this. Pick up radius. Oh, we found acceptance. We're gonna take the acceptance right now. Health and movement speed and luck. And uh, yeah, we're gonna take this. So I would like for for the things that I want to get from the epic upgrades, I want to get um, damage immunity window is bigger. I want and uh, effect damage is more. Those two are the most important things to get. Stay away from me. Everything. Man, water damage seems to be the worst one for me to dodge. Neutral damage, 11. Fire, 22. This is really good. I, I do enjoy what we rolled here. Nature damage is completely irrelevant. Electricity damage is also very irrelevant. But fire damage and fire resistance is already 81. It doesn't matter, we're gonna take this. So my worst resistance is neutral still. And neutral is the most important one. Neutral and water is, in my opinion, the most important one. Because fire is easy-ish to dodge, while, while water isn't that easy to dodge. Water attacks zigzag and expand and retract and in general are pretty huge in size. And now we're gonna get stronger, chonker, th stronger, chonker, or whatever this is called. Maybe I want to go a bit more into dex. I think dex is like crit chance in general, and crit chance is damage. So, you know, the one opponents are more powerful. I have 900... Or 945 life. 
Okay, now opponents don't die anymore. But I am getting a bunch of crits at this point. I just yolo it in there. Effect damage. This is what I want. I also want Berserk, by the way. But I guess effect damage is pretty much forced here. I mean, pretty much forced is nothing, but you know what I mean. Whoa, that was a lot of damage. Stay away from me, everything. I really mean stay away from me, everything. Man, do you see what's even happening? This 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 poison play is really strong. This this poison dust thing that I'm doing. Definitely really good. Poison them away. Go in there. Lifesteal. Pretty much straight up lifesteal. That's a lot of healing. 2% lifesteal. Yep, now we have actual, actual, uh, powerful, good lifesteal. Let's see what we get. Crit hit rate for free and neutral damage. Very nice. Fire resistance, electricity damage. I have too much fire resistance already. Electricity resistance and fire damage. All of these are useless. How much does this make him matter? Electricity resistance and fire damage. I'm not doing fire damage. I mean, I do do fire damage. Fire resistance, electricity damage. You know, I'm really thinking about not even providing the enemies anything. Uh... This this is this is doable. Do I want electricity? I, I don't want this though. I, I prefer actually making the game easier so that if I find something that I do actually want, um, the, the his rage is going to be on the lower end of things. So we can easily, you know, be like, okay, now I can steal two things, and then the boss is just uh, first of all actually not the boss. First of all is gonna uh, damage immunity as I said. Slash after dashing. This is also really good by the way. We're gonna take this. As I have been told that it's one of the better ones. I guess if madness ensues, it's gonna save me. Continue... Per poisoning everything. This is really good. This is really decent. The, the poison dust smoke here. Whatever this is. Regen. I really enjoy that we're getting free buffs, by the way. Red hit rate or uh, berserk. I'm gonna go with berserk. Hoping that I'm going to get the other thing that says um, while I am... Yeah, I, the, the, the Berserk combines with meditation. So not only does it happen when I'm low life, but also I it happens when I don't get hit for three seconds. And look at all this water madness going on. Push that guy off. No, 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 no. I'm, I'm risking here. I'm blocking a bunch of things. Is the boss toast? I'm telling you, man. Water enemies cover the whole screen with a million bubbles. You get hit. Water damage freezes enemies, reducing their movement speed. I had that at some point as a part of the build. I'm not doing... Oh, I'm, I'm shooting out icicles, actually. Uh, mm, I don't want these. No, I want the 10% life uh, HP regen. As I have a HP regen thing. I prefer the idea of icicles making an opponent slower. As I do actually shoot out an icicle every 0 0.5 or whatever. And also every time I right click and shoot out all these sparky sparks. That's also ice damage. Let's see what we get. Ooh, ho, 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 fire resistance, electricity resistance, godlike. Lose 5 strength but gain dash and everything but lose 5 strength. Block and electricity damage. Black is good. Every single resistance but lose the best resistance of all neutral. 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 I'm not going to take this. We're going to take this though. Or the block specifically. He's still not gonna be uh, remained. Um, yeah, when he is only giving the opponent speed, then until the next uh, boss, you will always have the. Um, yeah, he's gonna, not gonna be raging anymore. 10 HP region, this is what I want. Frozen enemies have 50% less movement speed and 20% less attack speed. I still continue with region though, that's literally what I wanted to take. And I guess the next one is gonna be. Oh, oh we're dying. But yeah, we are actually dying. No. Trying to push that enemy away. I'm still healing. Look how much. Look how fast we're healing, by the way. Like it, it's as if the, the this poison breath is a, an actual draining breath. Okay, movement speed and dash damage. Not really. We're gonna go here. The slash cooldown is reduced to two seconds and three strength. Effect damage, actually. Effect damage. <laughs> And I just lost my life, and I don't have a revive, so we're dying right here. Yep, it's over. <laughs> How do you lose so fast at the end, man? At the end, the game's like, you die now, and then just burst through. So uh, my record is 2,000. I died at 200. Yeah, that was that was very fast. Too many shrooms at the end. Yeah, it's always too many shrooms at the end. Let's see damage-wise. 
Poison Spray, really good. Venom Tooth, also really decent. Poison in general. Wow, Poison in general did 13% of my overage damage, average damage. I love that. Also did a lot of nature and water damage and fire damage. Actually, this is what I took, right? No, this is what I did. From Anger also increased our damage. I really enjoy that you can see exactly what part here was doing the damage. The throw oh, and the swing. Yeah, the, the, or the slash. I'm not, I'm not really sure. I guess the slash is... Yeah, attack, swing, special throw. So this thing is down here. Wow. And the slash, I'm assuming, is this. Icicle Spear. Oh, the slash is the passive. The slash is the passive. Which uh, I can't see. I can't see my passives. Yeah, the slash is the passive slash. Icicle Spear did also very decent damage. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Overwhelming power is the thing that when we leveled up, we did damage. Nice. Let's go see our leaderboard. Did anything change? Here we are, the Sift crew. Sift fan, Sift, but Sift. Sift can't read. This is me. <laughs> this over here is me. <laughs> so, yeah, most likely gonna play Lightning build tomorrow. And uh, I did enjoy this run. I'm most likely gonna play with her again because I still believe she has the best passives. But maybe I should play with the Lightning Lady once. She also has the Lightning Dash. Short range dash, dealing 120 electricity damage, cool on 3 seconds. I don't enjoy that that much, to be honest. But um, yeah, maybe a lightning build with portable lightning and lightning shock. Like shock hands, shock strike. Maybe with thunder blade. This does 22 damage. Written double. Slows enemies, buffs player speed. Unlimited range lightning, 108 damage. What does this do? Oh, you know what? We're going to check these out tomorrow. For now, that's going to be it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed. I really enjoyed the whole idea of going with the serpent stick poison build. And um, yeah, I think it is a good weapon. I think we lost there at the end. If, uh, if we just had a bit of a better run going on, we could have survived, in my opinion. But anyway, that's going to be it. Hope you guys enjoyed. As always, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Oh, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe, etc, etc. And as always, thanks for watching. And see you guys around.